Pochelia Nights Pruenosis, also known as the Powder Blue Isopod or Powder Blue Sobug, is a species of isopod that is popular in the pet trade and commonly kept in terrariums or vivariums. These isopods are characterized by their striking blue-gray coloration, which gives them their name. They have a segmented body with seven pairs of legs and a pair of antennae. Typically, they range from 10 to 15 mm in length, although larger individuals can reach up to 20 mm. In their natural habitat, Pochelianites pronosis isopods are found in moist, forested areas, often under rocks, logs, or leaf litter. They prefer humid environments with plenty of organic matter. These isopods are detritivores, meaning they feed on decaying plant material, helping to break it down and recycle nutrients back into the soil. They are also known for their ability to roll up into a ball when threatened, a defense mechanism called kinglobation. When it comes to caring for Pochelianites pruenosus isopods in captivity, it's important to provide them with a suitable enclosure, such as a terrarium or vivarium, with plenty of hiding spots like cork bark, leaf litter, and pieces of wood. The enclosure should have proper ventilation while maintaining high humidity levels, around 70 to 80 percent. The substrate should retain moisture well, and options include coconut fiber, peat moss, or a mixture of soil and sand. Keep the substrate moist but not waterlogged. Maintain a temperature range of 20 to 26 degrees Celsius, 68 to 78 degrees Fahrenheit and provide a heat source like a heat mat or ceramic heat emitter if necessary. Eye supports like Pochelianites pruenosis do not require special lighting beyond a natural day-night cycle. However, if live plants are present in the enclosure, provide appropriate lighting for their growth. Feeding should consist of a varied diet including decaying plant matter, leaf litter, fruits, vegetables, for example, carrots, cucumbers and commercial isopod food. Avoid feeding them citrus fruits or foods high in sugar. Provide a shallow dish of clean, dechlorinated water for drinking, and mist the enclosure regularly to maintain humidity levels. Regular maintenance is important, including removing uneaten food, feces, and moldy substrate to prevent bacterial growth and maintain a clean environment. Monitor the population size and adjust feeding accordingly to ensure the well-being of the isopods. Thanks for watching. Please like, subscribe and share it with your friends.